Now to a very rather disturbing story. A 29-year-old man has allegedly defiled twin girls in the central region. The man is alleged to have taken advantage of the 13-year-old victims who had been sent on errand by their mother, tied them, and forcibly had sex with them one after the other. He subsequently warned them not to tell anybody lest they die. Richard Kojanyako has been investigating the matter. He reports the 29-year-old has been arrested by the APAM police, but the victim's mother has come under intense pressure to agree to an out-of-court settlement. The two girls, for the purposes of the story, would be called Isi and Eresi, share how they were brutally defiled by the 29-year-old man and warned not to tell anybody about it, lest they die. The twins live with their mother in someone's uncompleted burden, where they has been asked to be the caretaker. We were sent by our mother to go and buy something for her. On our way, he called us to come. We were a bit hesitant, but we went. Upon getting there, he sent me to go and buy Coca-Cola for him. He warned me to keep long, and if I don't, he will beat me. The second of the twins continues the narration. When my sister left, the man pulled me into his room to watch TV while we wait for my sister. When we got to the room, he pushed me on his bed, tied me and threatened me to keep quiet. Should I defy his orders, he would kill me. He defiled me and warned me not to tell anybody. And then her sister returned after buying the Coca-Cola. They narrate the suspect and the first of the twins had then come to sit outside after the act. He told the second of the twins to send the cook to his room and then he followed up. He tied me and slept with me and warned me not to breathe a word about it to anybody lest I die. I was afraid and could not tell anyone. He slept with us in this way for three times. Some youth in the area suspected what had happened, went to tell the mother of the twins. A report was made to the police and a medical form was issued. Mother of the twins tells Joy News he feels pressured to bring the matter home to be settled. <laughs> The boys in the area came to tell me that someone has slept with my daughters. I asked my daughters and they confessed. When we went to the police station, the father of the suspect came to me and told me he would take care of the children so I should let us settle the matter at home. I refused. The suspect is in the custody of the Palm Police and is due to be put before the court, but it appears the single mother of the twins is facing threats even from the very men that helped her initially. Abna, whose husband died about five years ago, feels pressured and wants to be supported to seek justice for her twins. Richard Kwejenya Akon, Joy News, Apam.